This is the third year we've done our STEM camp. STEM is science, technology, engineering, and math. And uh, thanks to all of the hard work from the folks at EVV and Tri-State Aero, uh, we are able to end this successful week and really connect the dots between what we've talked about this week and real life application. It's kind of a unique day here at the airport. We have the great opportunity to host not only the air show performers, but one of the SEMO summer camps. They came out, they've been studying aviation all week, but they came out today to actually see, touch, smell, and experience it to some degree. If we were gonna take you guys on a flight lesson today, I would scoot this young man all the way up. Ooh, I can cry. All week we've talked about things like aerospace and airplanes and engineering. Um, so the kids not only get to be inside of these really cool planes and talk to these really nice pilots, um, but they get to see the wings that we constructed out of paper. And, and we've talked about lift and drag and thrust all week. So now they get to actually see it in action. And you'd be surprised at the difference it makes in, in a child's education when they get to actually see the real world application. They're getting a total immersion into aviation, if you will. It's just kind of neat to see their excitement. You know, they're saying, wow, I've never been in an airplane before, and they've got to actually touch and feel the controls. When I pull six Gs and I weigh 150 pounds, and I pull six Gs, guess how much I weigh inside the cockpit sitting in the plane? 900 pounds. It's pushing me down with 900 pounds of force. When you get kids young, uh, and get that the sense of wonder, the magic, the, I keep describing it as the defying gravity. Uh, if you get people who want to defy gravity, uh, they're more inclined not to just to, to learn about aviation, but to learn about so many other things and kind of strive to reach the stars. It was my very first time getting close to a, this close to a plane and inside one, in the cockpit, in a seat. It was just so amazing. It's been really awesome because I've never seen the cockpit of an actual plane before. I've just flown in a plane. After today, I'm really considering being a pilot. Because we bank this airplane all the time. What do you think? Uh, it, it, it just stays flying. It just stays crooked? Well, what? It turns. That's how airplanes turn. So when you put the bank in, the airplane will start turning in the direction that it's tilted. And this is a great opportunity for everybody, right? There, there's nothing most pilots like more than talking about airplanes. They like flying airplanes, like talking about them, they like talking with people that are excited about planes. Um, so the chance to sit down with the kids, you know, it's as exciting for the pilots as it is for the kids. They like answering the questions. Uh, some of the pilots today are actually teachers, so they're used to dealing with kids, but it's nice to deal with kids that actually care about what they're talking about and have that shared passion. Flying's fun for all of us, but what we really like to do is meet people. And today was just exceptional to have all these kids out here and just the enthusiasm they show. And for me, my one goal is to every share show that I attend that if I can just put a little bit of enthusiasm and motivation into one student that becomes a pilot someday, that's awesome. What aviation did for me as a young person is it got me to thinking about why I was actually learning math and science. So we're hoping that makes uh, the connection for some of the kids. And obviously, maybe some of them might choose aviation as a career path. The pilots are rock stars to them. They're all racing to see how many autographs they can get. So it's just been a really exciting day, and I know the kids are taking away memories that they'll cherish for a long time.